Hello, I'm Ederson Oliveira. I'll be presenting this video for dnnhere.com. In this video, I'll be showing how you can create a new style definition, a new CSS definition inside your, the text editor. So you can, you can apply that definition anytime that you want. Let me show exactly what I'm talking about here. Let's log into the back end of this test site. This is a DNN6 website and it's running in my local system. I'm going to log in as host. And let's have a look here. Let's go to my test page. I'm, this is a text HTML module. I'm going to go to manage, edit content. And from here, I what I want to do is I want to be able to select uh, a text and I want to apply a style to this text. I want to Again, just select, apply the style, and the style will all be there. It might invo it might involve colors, font size, uh, font family, uh, weight, all any anything defined that can be defined in the CSS. You can you can do it here. So how can you go about doing that? First of all, let's open the site files of our website. Again, this site is running in my local system. So I have the root folder of my site here. I'm just gonna go to portals. Zero is the idea of my portal. I'm gonna go to the root folder of my uh, of the portal. And if you are using, if you're running out of the box DNN, this file called editor.css will not be there. So you have to create this file. It can be initially an empty file, and then you, you're gonna define your style inside this file. So again, it won't be there, but you can create the CSS yourself. So in my case, it's already here because I have already uh, used that in the past. So I'm gonna open the editor.css, which is right here. There's already a definition there. Let's not worry about that. I'm gonna add my new definition there. And the style, I'm gonna call it my big text. So my big text is defined as having a, is, as being bold, 30 pixels. So we can really highlight that, so we can really see it. Background color yellow and the font color will be red. So we just have to save this. I'm gonna go back to the site. Let's close this and open it again. So let's go to manage, edit content. And now if we click under apply CSS, you're gonna see my big text here as one of the styling options available to apply to the text. Let's give it a try. Let's select this piece of text and let's apply the style. Perfect, we can see it here in the editor. That's what we wanted. That's the first step that we want to happen. Now, let's have a look and let's save this. Let's scroll down. Let's save this. Okay, we have saved. The text is here, but the formatting is not here. If we go back to manage, edit content, you see the format is here. So as you can see, you the format is inside the editor, but not outside the editor yet. What do we have to do? We have to add the same style that we have added to the editor.css, we have to add it to the skin.css as well. So I'm just gonna copy this style. I'm going to paste inside the skin file at the bottom. And I'm gonna save this. I'm gonna go back to the site. I'm going to save this again. And now, as you can see, our formatting was a what is showing up because we have applied the format in the skin as well. So this is basically how you can create a new style to apply to any text you want throughout the website. And again, you have to keep that style definition synchronized between the editor.css and the skin.css, which I have covered that a little bit in a, in a previous video. Okay, so that's it. Thank you very much and bye for now.